Yes, sir. What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to Soul Priority. Of course, I'm your man, Mo, and today, we're gonna be doing a little bit of unboxing, man. I got an early release that came in, and we're about to check it out. Hey, but before we do that, y'all make sure y'all head over to Instagram and holler at us at underscore Soul Priority. Y'all wanna know anything about us, anything about our sneakers, what we got going on, sneaker news, and things of that sort, man. Y'all just head on over to that. And then we'll let y'all know what's going on, all right? All right. Now, I know it's been a while since y'all seen your boy in the flesh on YouTube. You feel me? Well, what I did was, man, we're going to get off into this before I get off into the sneakers. I decided to take a break, you know, from in front of the camera and do some things behind the scenes, man, because y'all know algorithms and things of that nature, man, take place and priority over a lot of stuff when it, you know, when it comes to YouTube. So what I did was I wanted to grow the channel as much as I could for a month because I wanted to reach that 500 mark as fast as I could and with original content, you know what I'm saying, man, and just putting the groundwork in to do it. So what I did was I went ahead and created a whole lot of shorts, man, because I would reach more people that way. So, of course, it worked. The channel grew past 500, so it actually got beyond what I wanted it to do. I'm actually at, like, I think 525 right now. And for me, man, that pretty doggone good. Y'all feel me? You know what I'm saying, man? We doing this thing brick by brick. Now, y'all stay tuned for my next video because I'm going to do something special, man, for real, for real, for the 500 people that's following me. I'm going to give y'all a chance to win something, man. Probably one of these Travis's or something like that, man. Give y'all a chance to win one. You know what I'm saying? On my next uh, video, I'll probably do a giveaway. But that's neither here nor there. I know y'all here to see the sneaker that we about to unbox, man. Y'all feel me? Now, my male man just left, of course, and uh, he brought me something special. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to unbox this thing real quick. Let, 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 let's see what we got. You feel me? Now, I'm pretty excited about this sneaker, man. Um, I'm going to say that. Now, with this sneaker, I told y'all again, man, I'm trying to get sneakers, you know, that Jordan played in, meaning like one through like, I think like 14 or 15, something like that. So I'm trying to get my hands on all the OGs. Now, what I left off with you guys was I had um uh, the Jordan 2 come in. Now, y'all can see it right there. I got it right there. For those of y'all that were wondering, did I actually get that sneaker? Did I keep it, sell it, whatever? No, it's in the collection. It's right there. So y'all can see I got my Jordan 2s right there, which I still might do a review on them. It was just so many reviews on this sneaker at the time of the release, man. It was like, ah, my squad already done seen them. You know what I'm saying? So they're like, it really ain't no reason for me to do it. But, of course, I want the squad to know that I did get my hands on them twos, which was my last cop of 2023. Now, this sneaker right here is my my personal uh, purchase, first personal purchase for myself, as far as Jordans go this year in 2023. So to start 2023 off with me, I wanted to make sure I had this sneaker, of course, because I wanted to go inside the collection. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be one of them a keep. It ain't going nowhere, no trade bait, nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to keep this sneaker because Jordan himself wore it. You feel me? So, we'll go ahead. I'm going to get the box out so y'all can see what we got. Put that on the floor. And by the look of the box, yeah, yeah. Y'all already know what time it is, man. The Air Jordan. Yeah, well, I ain't going to even say it. I ain't gonna say we're gonna get a thumbnail first. You feel me? They go ahead and get that thumbnail for the people. Feel me? So uh yeah, man. I went ahead. Of course, y'all know Nike did a shock drop on these. Um I think it was last week, bro. They did a shock drop on these. And uh I got mine today, this morning. So of course I wanted to get this out to the squad to let y'all see that I did end up copping the playoff 13s, man. So before we get off into the shoe, I'm gonna let y'all see the box, price tags, and all that, man. You know, the pricing and all of that. So I think tax and everything, when I paid, uh, it came out to like, I think it was 224, you know, when it came out. But here's the box right here. You know, plain gray box. Of course, you got that Jordan 
jump man right here on the top of the lid in red. Underneath, man, really nothing really going on, man. As y'all can see, underneath, nothing really going on underneath. But of course, again, this is a classic sneaker and one that Jordan wore himself. So, of course, man, I had to have it for my collection. So I'm gonna go ahead, we are gonna pop the lid on this thing real quick. And we are gonna take a look at it. You know what I'm saying? Oh man, it's nice. My wife peeking in on me, y'all. She wanna know what's going on in here. But bam, y'all see it right there, man. The Air Jordan 13 playoff, man. Clean sneaker, drum wore this thing himself. I'm glad to have for my collection, man. All black upper, midsole, white underneath. You got the white and red underneath, man, of course. They always say you got that lizard eyeball right there, man. A snake eyeball right there under the bottom, man, with the Jordan jump, man, on that. And then again, man, you got this uh, jump, man, right here, too on this side right here man pretty pretty dope if i do say so myself let me get the other one out man because i'm gonna try and do this all in one you feel me because i know y'all don't have y'all opportunity to see these things up close and personal through a lot of different um you know reviews from people who had them before i did you know resellers but uh yeah you know people that don't have them before me but this is mine straight from nike y'all already know i tell everybody that come over to my channel before i review this thing i do uas and i do retail so this is actually my retail pair right here so y'all get a chance to see it right here this is a retail pair all right now again, like I said, man, these bad boys is clean. Um, Jordan wore these himself. The Jordan playoffs is just it's something I had to have for my collection, man. And uh, for those of y'all that want to know the quality of these things, and you know, I'd probably end up doing like an on foot, so y'all can um, you know, know if you know they true to size or whatever. But y'all can see the leather on that thing right there is, man. Y'all see that right now? Yeah, buddy. Then we're going to spin this thing around. That classic uh, 13 shape. Y'all hear my wife talking about it. Now she's going to come open my door, leave it cracked, and then you be talking. Hold on, let me close my door, man. Y'all stay put. Stay right there. All right. Now we're back. All right. So again, man, this is my retail pair right here. All right, y'all. Sorry about that interruption, man. My wife be in and out. But, um, yeah, I mean, if you ask me, am I happy with it? Overall, I'm happy with it. And I'm glad to have it in my collection. Let's take a, let's take a look at that Jordan Jumpman on the tongue right there. Y'all can see that? Y'all see that right there? That's what it looked like. Um, No extra laces with it or nothing like that. So we didn't get an extra lace with it. Just uh, just the black lace, which I'm cool with that. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't switch it out anyway. You know what I mean? Uh, as far as the shoe go, again, man, classic sneaker. I'm glad to have it. Carbon fiber. Man, this thing just, it's just, it's a, it's an all-out dope sneaker, man. And it, of course, it's going down there in the chambers. Bam! Going down there in the vaults. It's going down there in the boxes, in the cases. And it ain't going nowhere. I probably rock this sometime in the summer, man. I, I'm gonna probably keep this one or uh, dead stock to the summertime and pull it out in the summer. You know what I'm saying? Here's the left shoe right here. Just all out dope, man. Y'all feel me? Now I call QC slipping. They got I got some, I don't know what that is on the back right there, but got a little, got a little something, something on the back right there. But y'all can see that 23 eyeball again right there peeking out. You know what I'm saying? And, of course, y'all, like I said, man, this is a dope sneaker. And, of course, like I mentioned before, this is my retail pair. Side 12 for those of y'all that um, want to know. You know what I'm saying? But, again, it's just all like perfection when it comes to these bad boys right here. Now, I ain't going to hold y'all that long. I just want the squad to see that I did end up getting the playoffs. And uh, the quality on these things are pretty doggone good. So for those of you that want a pair, y'all still got the opportunity to get a pair, man. Don't just jump out there and pay resale for them. I'm going to tell y'all that now because I think they drop next week or something like that, man. I'll put the date over here somewhere 
So um, y'all know the actual date that they drop on the um, sneaker app and at your regular stores or whatnot. For those of you that did not get early pass from Nike, you know what I'm saying? Now, for those of y'all that don't mind rocking the UAs, they do have the UA pair of these already available. So for those of you that are interested in getting them early and y'all don't give a damn if they retail or not, like your boy, hey, you can go ahead and get a pair for yourself UAs that that is, you know what I'm saying? And the box and everything, all the 13, they did very well. Everything updated in the whole now. I might get a pair here to do a retail um versus UA. Oh shoot, I dropped the damn sneaker. But yeah, I might end up um grabbing a pair so you guys can see what that pair looked like. Um hopefully they did the damn thing to the point to where you can't tell nothing, which at this point in time. You really can't tell nothing with UAs and on um, retails nowadays anyway. But again, man, I just want to bring that thing on in here, man, so y'all can take a look at it. Of course, like I said, man, I'm glad to have these. I'm glad to have them a part of my collection. And uh, yeah, man, we're going to keep going. Um, the next shoe I would like to show you guys would probably be the sixes or something like that, man. This week, of course... Um, I think Nike is dropping that, um, what is it, that, that, it's a four, that, it's two fours that's dropping, I think it's the craft four, I think that's what they're calling it, that dropped Saturday, and then they got like a, a green, uh, green, uh, oil green, or whatever they calling it, um, the four that drops on Thursday, so it's two fours that drop this week, I'm gonna be honest with y'all, either one, if I had to get my hands on them, it'll be for uh, um like a flip or something like that. Cause I really don't, I really don't need them for my collection. I'm being very, very picky on what I choose this year as far as sneaker go. My personal collection will be just you know like things that Jordan had on foot himself. And again, um that uh the three that's getting ready to drop. Of course, we all know everybody gonna want that and I do want that for my collection. So my next personal purchase will be the uh the three. And of course that uh I do before we get up out of here, I know I'm rambling, but before we get up out of here, I do want to get my hands on that uh it's a black and white uh Jordan. I forget what they're calling it, but of course I want to get my hands on that too. So those are just some of the ones that I want to get my hands on, you know, early this year. You know, before we get off in the summer. So, again, man, I'm glad that you guys always come through. Don't mean to talk y'all to death, but of course, man, when these hit the door, I want to make sure, man, I let the crew know that I did get my hands on my 13s. I did get them. Again, here go that look before we get up out of here. Y'all see that? And again, these are retail. This is a retail pair. So, again, this is my retail pair. And I want to make sure I show them to the squad. You feel Now, this has been your boy Mo. I'm getting ready to get up out this thing, man. I'm reaching that 15 minute mark. And I just want to say, man, welcome to the channel for those of y'all that have come to the channel, man. Thank you guys for, you know, the 500 followers. I'm over that now, man. We're going off into a thousand, man. Hopefully we can reach that mark pretty soon. I'm glad to have each and every one of y'all over here on the channel, man. Love each and every one of y'all for coming through, leaving comments, likes, and the whole nine, man. Y'all make sure y'all like and comment on this video as well. Let me know what y'all think about the 13s, man, these playoff 13s. Y'all let me know what y'all think about these bad boys. Of course, I love them. You know what I'm saying? All right, man. So we're going to get on up out of here, man. Sorry to keep rambling, but appreciate each and every one of y'all, man. Salute, man. And I'll see y'all on the next video. All right? All right, man. We gone.